My lord, are you sure about this? I know we are in an alliance, but this attack on Hefei is entirely to their benefit, I know. They probably have their sights set on Han Zhong. It does not matter. If we must include Liu Bei in order to destabilize Cao Cao, then so be it. I see. Give and take, as they say. Though, I must admit, I don't like the fact that we are doing the giving first. <laughs> Just so long as we can call in the favor later. Ha! Who cares about the details? Just point me at the fighting and let me charge into the fray. Ha! You hothead. How about trying to use that brain of yours for once? Actually, Gan Ning makes a good point. The enemy defense is being led by Zhang Liao himself. Both determination and focus will be required to win. Hmm. True enough. It will take the full might of Wu to achieve victory. If you gentlemen are so determined to show your strength, then please allow Lu Su and I to display our intellect. Ah, Master Zhou Yu. Are you feeling better? Yes, thanks for your concern. We have compiled a detailed analysis of the enemy formations and terrain. Gan Ning, Ling Tong, listen carefully. Just charging in will get you nowhere. Hey, don't lump me in with him. <laughs> This is it. We must show the world the courage and brilliance of the men of Wu. Hey there guys and welcome back to Wu's hypothetical route. This is going to be the Battle of Hefei again, this time taking the other route. Now I can't exactly remember what uh, I did last time, but I think the objects have, yeah, objectives have changed a bit here. And honestly, this one doesn't take that long anyway, uh, especially since I'm playing this on beginner, but I figured I would show the entire thing anyway. But yeah, he, they get me to start over in this direction for some reason this time. I'm not entirely sure why, but I can't remember if it was like this the first time or not. But yeah, a lot of this is just me running around with Gan Ding and killing everyone in sight. And honestly, it doesn't take that long. I thought Somewhere something might happen down there, but no, apparently I'm just meant to go north. So because this is on beginner, it is not going to take that long at all, but I figured I would at least show this. Uh, I did for the other modes, I believe, so yeah. Obviously, there's no optional objectives to do here. It's pretty much just finish the mission and it will continue on the other route. Which is going to lead us to five, I believe it's five more maps, and then we're pretty much done with Wu, and I can finally start Jin and maybe eventually finish this. I don't know. Don't <laughs> don't count on me for that. But yeah, I I think I just waste time here by killing a lot of people I don't really need to. There's not even anyone in here for some reason. I don't, I don't really know why, but whatever. But uh, yeah. And I'm pretty sure this, uh, all I really need to do on this mission is actually quite straightforward. All I had to do was really um, go over to the west and then come back and then go up there and kill the boss. I can't even remember who it was actually. Was it Soapy? I can't even remember. Yeah, whatever. It probably is. Actually, no, it was Zhang Liao, yeah. Because you kill him multiple times here. So I believe it was him that you have to kill to end the mission. But yeah, really, it does not take that long. Even if I was playing this on normal, it really wouldn't take that long at all. I don't know if that's because Gang Ning's weapon's really good or his stats are really good or something. And yeah, I'm waiting for the ladder here because you do actually need to wait. 
And there we go. And of course, climb the ladders like this, of course. Alright, so, yeah, I believe all we really need to do is go over to the, the north here, and that's pretty much the end once you start going round the side. I, I really don't recall if there was any... I believe last time you had to chase Jiang Liao to the bottom of the map, as I recall. But in this one, you actually just stay and attack. I think that's pretty much the only difference. And it might actually be quicker this way. And of course, I'm waiting around for the door to open. But yeah, Li Dian once again have to take this guy out. And Jiang Liao. Seriously, the amount of times you take him out is pretty ridiculous. Honestly, it is. There's like 80 something generals and it just seems like the same ones that you keep taking out, but maybe it's just me. But yeah, Gang Ming's weapon is actually pretty nice. It's pretty fast too. I actually do like it. A lot of people liked his river sword. I believe it was called a river sword before, but I don't know. I, I think I said this before, but I just thought it was just an R sword move set that wasn't that great, honestly. Also, Sun Lang right there. It's probably not Lang, but you know. But yeah, I, a lot of people liked his River Sword and kind of complained when they took it out. I think it was Dynasty Warriors 5 ish or something. I never played 5, but uh, yeah. But uh, I don't really mind because the River Sword was okay and everything. It looked cool, but his moveset was pretty much just the standard sword one, so. You know, this is a lot more interesting with a flail, though it is pretty similar to the, um, is it the sickle? I believe the sickle is kind of similar to that. Oh yeah, you, there's like four or five generals you need to take out here. That's really the only difficult part of this, you know, I, I, I guess you could call it difficult. Obviously, since this is beginner, I take them out in one move, so. I could have used my rage me right there and it probably would have worked just as well. That's a, yeah. Now I couldn't remember if I actually went Gang Ming. Uh, out of all the playable characters on the scenario I wasn't sure about Gang Ming. I think I went him before but I was just making sure really. So all you really need to do is defend against two more generals here who pop out. Of course this these two come back again because yeah, we gotta fight them again. I mean, I like the guy's hook swords and everything, but Jesus. And then we pretty much take out whoever the general is here that I can't remember. It is Jiang Liao, okay. And I think that's the end of the mission, I believe. Yep. Humiliation. How could this have happened? I'll tell you how, shall I? We fight for more than just ourselves. My father, my brother, they led us here. And we must strive to surpass them. Three generations of Wu wisdom and courage gathered under you. Then I must simply seek to overcome that too. For now, I praise your brilliance. Hey! You can't get away! Leave him! <clears throat> this battle is over. We will face him again soon enough. A most impressive victory, my lord. Yes, Zhou Yu. You are the one who led us to it. My father and brother have returned to us too. I don't think I have ever felt quite so happy in battle. Wait. Was my brother not with you? I'm sure he will be here soon. But, my lord... This victory belongs not to your brother. 
or to your father, but to you. Everyone is waiting to hear you speak. My comrades, you have fought well. Let out a shout of victory. This day belongs to Wu! Okay, so that's the intro into the hypothetical route, and it's just going to go over some stuff before we head into the next mission. So I'm probably going to play the next mission, provided it's not that long in this video after this, because it's not really a big deal. It shouldn't really be that difficult anyway, but there is a certain optional objective for, I believe, the next three maps after this, actually. So, I'll probably try and get all three of those if I can. But after that, we should be able to go into Jin storyline, and by that point, I will have unlocked the eight other maps or scenarios. So, I'll be able to play through them. And then I'll probably be mostly done with this game, man. I mean, I might play Conquest mode a little bit more, but yeah, I don't know. One thing for certain is though that it is a lot more smoother than Dynasty Warriors 3 and such because I went back to play them and uh, yeah, a lot of frame frame trouble and stuff like that. Alright guys, we are back with Dynasty Warriors 8 and we are ready to continue with Wu's hypothetical uh, storyline. So this is the first one right here, it already has an optional objective as you can see. And you can actually play uh, Sun Jian in this map, which is quite good, but I probably won't be playing as him anyway. Alright, so I am going to pick normal, of course. And yeah, so I'm going to try and complete this optional objective. I've looked up and it seems pretty easy anyway. You just need to follow, I believe it's Ding Feng around. I'm going to go check that in case I get it wrong. But I believe it is Ding Feng. And I forget how his name is actually <laughs> said, but yeah, yes it is. Alright, so yeah, I think you pretty much just gotta follow him and stick with him throughout the map. It's something like that. And all that really happens for doing so is he will appear in the next map after this. Which also has a side, side map as well, if you do the objective there as well. So I'm probably going to be going uh, Tai Chi Chi, I think. I don't know if I went him yet. Let me uh, let me actually check this. If I can't, if I have actually been able to go him yet. I don't think so, but I might be wrong. So I'll be going him. I think I played the other three for definite. Yeah. Definitely played the other three. Yeah, it looks like I have not played as this guy yet. So that's fine. Gotta, gotta get the rake in there, right? Yes, I have not. Alright, so ready to go this guy. This guy... I don't know, I don't really like his weapon, I think I said it before, but... Eh, whatever. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna be chasing after someone on this map. Duty does not fade. Let us go to battle. But we can just follow this one unit around and basically do that objective. That's not like you, my lord. I thought seizing the momentum was your specialty. Besides, we may never get another chance like this. Chance? I see. If we move the battle lines up to Buffet, we can bring Shochu under our command. That will give Jianye further protection, and at the same time, open the way to Shu Chong. Yes, Wei is also surely aware of this. If 
we pause for breath now, they will strengthen the defenses of Shochun. Is that so? Then there's only one thing left to do. Yes. We can't let Chuan shoulder everything. Come. Let our fangs tear open a path for the young tiger. Yes, father. I'm with you. Ha! 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 All right, so let me let me just check immediately where the guy is I'm looking for. So he is just below us. All right, so I should be able to just go kill this guy here, and then I'm pretty much just gonna follow follow that guy for the rest of the map. And yeah, I'll kill a few of these guys first. Yeah, I don't like this guy's weapon that much, but whatever, it's not that bad, I guess. You could always switch to the rake. God damn it. I'm getting juggled. I'm getting juggled, wow. Okay. I gotta admit, it's pretty decent. Jesus, man. This guy has been able to hit me from miles away. Jesus. Alright. Oh my god. Alright. Let's, uh, let's try this then, I suppose. Damn it. Should have tried this other. So whatever. Okay, we're getting dealt with finally. All right, so this guy should be. Just look at that. This guy should be around this corner here. I couldn't do better myself. And this is the guy I'm gonna follow. Is he around here? I guess he's went on ahead. It looks like it. Uh, oh, okay. He's going up to the uh, top of the map. All right. I never actually noticed him. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll be following this guy. That might mean that I'm actually able to choose him the next map, which I believe I have not done as well. Alright. If we can get some health, I suppose. There we go. Alright, so we just stick around this guy. There is a mission it gives you, but... Uh, if you do want to get the optional objective, you are going to have to basically just stay with this guy throughout the mission. But we'll get there. So hopefully this one isn't that lengthy, so I can kind of get this in with the uh, the other part. But if it is, I'll just separate them. It's not that big a deal. So just take out a few of these guys around here. I assume they're going to follow me at some point here. I mean, he's there right now. Northern Bridge, oh man. Yeah, uh, right, there's just this guy, I think. So I think he kind of sticks around this castle. Yeah, I think this is what you're waiting for right here. Basically, I'll give you a message here and... Even though it says you should go and save him, uh, I think I need to just wait around this area, really. I did not think I would be receiving any Let us turn the so I'm just going to stick around this guy for now. Because why not? And I believe it's timed as long as you uh, stick around him. I'm just gonna follow him, pretty much. Yeah, this is what happens. They'll go and and yes, I'm gonna follow him because I think you'll die if you do not do this. So yeah, preventing death sounds like a good idea. And man, am I ever gonna get this game finished? Seriously. Uh, right. It looks like I can't get up this way. I guess I gotta go into the actual camp. <coughs> Unless they jump down. Okay, they are jumping down. All right. Come on. Immediately, just uh, miss up. Yeah. Why not? All right. So he should have. I don't know if he has his uh, third missile yet. Let me check. I think that one is a grab. Usually, yes, he does. 
Uh, so I think it is a grab. Yep. Does a lot of damage as well. Alright, so I believe that's it after you, uh, you go and save him there. Actually, no, no. This guy appears, sorry. Once again, gotta take out Jim Leo, of course. And this gate will open, and yeah. I think we just need to take him out, and then that should be fine. He's over here, right? Yep. I'll just go and use this. Come on, do more damage, man. Yeah, he's gonna kill him anyway. Alright, so after that I think you can pretty much just go back and uh... Well, I don't, I don't really need to save anyone really. It looks like everything's covered there, but you will need to go back that way I believe to even get to the uh, boss up the top left there. Because there's no bridge over there. So yeah, you gotta go all the way around anyway. And this guy should be fine now. Otherwise, he would have died. I think. But, uh, yeah. Alright. And I didn't go and get the optional objective for one of the historical maps, but I'm not really too concerned about that. I didn't do that for some of Wei and Shu's ones, I believe. Alright, so finally get back here. Uh, oh, there is a, this guy is still actually here, though he really did nothing pretty much. Hey, where's my horse? Okay, <laughs> fine then. Alright, so I should be able to just run for the... Uh, run for uh, Sao P. I assume he's the, uh, the boss there. So I'm just going to run past all the other generals because I have no real point to sticking around on this map. So yeah. Oh man, why'd you gotta do this to me? Once again, this guy. Seriously. Second drawbridge. Okay, they... no, they don't have behind me, alright. All right, fine then. You are a fool to come out here alone. It's all with all fall prey. I'll take out your stupid fucking grip. All right, so his EX attack I believe was a uh, four and got down it. I think it was four attacks and then he's strong. Don't know if I can do it right here. Jeez, man. Let's try and get a grab in there. I'm serious, these do like so much damage. There we go. That one, that one isn't bad too. It's just pretty His weapon's just pretty slow in general, which is kind of annoying. Also, you cannot move this beam here, which you gotta be obviously set up to actually hit people with it before you start using it. Okay, he's gonna... Oh yeah, I forgot about this guy right here. God damn it. Stunned me. I've been taking a beating in this fucking In this map right here. Alright, there we go. God damn! Well, he broke my guards. Well, didn't really do anything else. That's the thing, you can pretty much block all the Musos anyway. But, yeah. Alright, so I think that's all that I need to do here, right? Yep. And we can keep going up here. Alright. So... I assume I just need to get to the top here. I'm just gonna run past these guys if I can. Come on. I doubt I can actually make it. Alright, okay. It's telling me to do it, so I'll do it. I don't know if I need to, but yeah. 
I will patrol the surrounding area. There's a few guys there, though. I'll just use this attack right here. Try and do it pretty quickly. So yeah, getting to the end of Wu's storyline here will probably not be that big a deal. There's really not that many maps left. I just need to remember to try and do them, because I take forever to get them done. But uh, yeah, there we go. I guess I'm probably going to have to guide these two up to the base, so whatever. So they were... They just run past that guy? Alright. I'll do that too then. I need to take you out again? God damn it. Alright, fine. There we go. If I can get this guy with that. Aww. Well, the other guy. Whatever then. I'll just take out these random guys, why not? Jesus, there's a lot of officers right here. Okay. And I gotta take you out as well. Damn it. Am I gonna have to go up there too? Looks like it. Alright, can I just like get... No. It is. The door is shut. Okay. That prevents all my attacks, of course. Well done. You performed admirably. No point trying to make logic of this, really, to be honest, but yeah. Alright, take out these two then. Try this again. Okay. I was trying to do the grab move, but oh well. <laughs> I didn't hold down R1. Kind of, it's kind of annoying to hold down R1 then press circle, because uh, R1 will swap your weapon if you just press it on its own. Anyway, this guy's done pretty much. Yep. All right, so I think that's all I need now. Eh, there we go. I've had enough of this fucking the fucking archers. But All right, so I think I just need to take out these two. Okay, let's just do it. <laughs> that one isn't bad, to be fair. Uh, where are you? Okay, there he is. <laughs> All right, that was the that was the lot of attacks there. Okay, again, man, that storm rush happens way too often, honestly. Alright, so this should open and then give me final boss guy here. So IP, I assume. Alright, let's let's just do this, because why not? Look how many people are in this. Seriously. So many of these guys. Well. And there we go. Magnificent! Father! Brother! There you are! We were just finishing up! You broke through the enemy defenses? With no more men than this? I knew it. You should be the one leading Wu. I give everything back to you. <sighs> what are you talking about? It's only thanks to you that we've made it this far. But... But... Now, Wu is united under your grand ideals.
All we can do is support you and help however we can. Brother, please. Father, can't you convince him? <laughs> I left everything to him, remember? I can't get involved again now. <sighs> Father. <sighs> like I said, it's all yours. Go and get them, Twan. Hmm. Go forth, my son. A new era is waiting for you to seize it. Very well. You have entrusted Wu to me, and I will not let you down. Alright, so I assume there would have been a cutscene, I'm not sure about Ding Fang, or maybe he's just forgotten. I have no idea how you say his name. The guy with the massive moon <laughs> blade thing. He had the gauntlets in 7, which actually were pretty decent for him. <laughs> but, yeah. So I believe you might get to control him in the next map if he does survive here. Let me check. Um, I'm looking at the wrong thing, right. Um, there we go. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like you actually do get to control them for some reason. I don't know why. Oh well. But yes, there's only like... There's only four other maps to go through, pretty much. So yeah, we've got the next one, and it does have a side mission there, and th that actually has an optional objective as well, and then we got the last two, which don't have any. So yeah, as you can see, the only one that uh, would be here is this guy right here, I think, because, uh, yeah. Otherwise, I think I've, I think I've played as these four before, anyway, as far as I know. But anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time on Dynasty Warriors 8.